Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Phil here from Geofergus Fishkeeping and it's time for Five for Friday, episode nine. So this week, I've gone through that 10,000 views. I've gone through 200 subscribers. I'm absolutely mega pleased with both of those things. So thank you very much for your support. In terms of the topic last week, it doesn't mean a great deal to YouTube or what have you, but for me, I'm absolutely buzzing from it. So thank you very much. And hopefully you continue to support me and hopefully you continue to subscribe and enjoy watching my videos. I do have to apologize to anybody that watched right to the end of last week's main video, the Wednesday video from last week. I did say that on Five Friday, I will give you an update on the Freshwater Stingray Aquarium. Obviously that didn't happen, and you can probably guess why. However, this week, I couldn't go two weeks without giving you an update on it. I have got an update on it. Check this out. Ta -da! <laughs> Get in, it's got water in it, and not only has it got water in it, because we've been here before, it is holding the water in it. Fingers crossed it continues to do so. I am gonna leave it a couple of days just to get it running, just to get it up to temperature, etc., etc., just to make sure that that water does continue to hold. But we've got over that milestone. Finally, finally, it's got water in it. It's holding water. It seems to be sealed. I'm not too impressed with the latest resident in there though. He won't be happy, she won't be happy, whatever it is, when the water, water uh, continues to flow into the sun, a new home will be washed away. So the plan going forward now, hopefully over the weekend it will have continued to hold the water, it will have gone up to temperature, my cycled media will be going in, and the first fish will be going in. I won't be putting the stingrays in immediately, as long as everything's A-OK, -okay, they will be going in in the next week or so. I can't wait! And on top of that, I have organised some new stocking for it. A little reward, a little treat, maybe a little Father's Day gift to myself. Who knows? But there is some new stocking coming ready for the freshwater uh, Stingray Aquarium. The clue is in the title. <laughs> In other news, in terms of the Pellegrini, they're coming on really, really well. They're starting to put on some size. There's one or two that are starting to get a little bit bigger, so potentially males. And also, the coloration it really isn't there yet, but it is starting to show to come through. In terms of my main aquarium, well, it's pretty much as it was. Same stocking, same skate. Really, I'm just waiting on the Stingray Aquarium to get up and running and move the Stingrays across, and then I can really, really think about um, what stocking I want in my main aquarium, what scape I want in my main aquarium, whether I go live plants, etc, etc. And pretty much that's it guys, I just wanted to show you basically, I just wanted to show you the update of the Stingray Aquarium and to show you that it has water in, it's holding water and finally, fingers crossed, we can get it up and running as planned weeks ago. I just wanted to show you the update of the Sting Water Aquarium. Sting Water? Sting Water? I just wanted you to show, 